welcome or welcome back to another video today i'm going to be doing my 30 day review for the 310 nutrition shakes i know this video is long overdue i was supposed to record this video around july 9th today is the 13th i was just making a whole bunch of other videos and this one just didn't make the cut i'm sorry i do have my handy dandy notebook i have some notes written down in here that i'm going to be talking to you guys about I was supposed to record a separate video as far as like my meal plans showing you guys how I prepare my meals that itself was a whole process that I was not trying to do so really quick just to take you guys back to my two weeks review in that video I was just letting you guys know 10 different facts that I had came up with about the shakes to just give you guys a little bit of insight in case you were thinking about purchasing them the shakes completely stopped my cravings for sugar after like the first three days my starting weight was 193 and then i got down to 187 within the first two weeks of using the shakes and then i actually lost another three pounds so i got down to 184 and then i kind of teeter-tottered between 184 and 187 it was just going up and down at first i was writing down everything i ate throughout the day i would eat three times and then i would drink the shake um as my last meal of the day after june 23rd i don't know why i thought that it was acceptable to stop um logging my meals and after that i pretty much start eating reckless because I wasn't counting my calories anymore, I wasn't writing my meals down, and I wasn't keeping track. When I say eating reckless, I basically wasn't eating my fruits and vegetables anymore, and I kinda ate fast food a little bit. That was just a little teensy weensy mistake. When we went to the Mall of America, which if you haven't seen that video by the way, go and check it out. I will link it down in the description box. Um, but when we went to the Mall of America, I had Chick-fil-A that day and I wasn't even going to eat. I, we just happened, well, actually I was getting the kids something to eat that day and I came across it. So the other time that I had fast food was when I had went out to eat at Raisin Cane's and I wasn't even thinking about it. Honestly, every time we drive past it, I just see a ton of cars outside and I don't know. I don't know what happened. I just, I slipped up and yeah, I wish I hadn't. It was good for the moment, but I wish I hadn't did it. So yeah, that was the two times that I ate Chick-fil-A and Raisin Cane's, and that was pretty much it. I haven't went back to eating fast food. I've been having snacks like every other day. I, ooh, it was, it's, ooh, it's just been all over the place for these shakes. So as far as my meals went, um, I wrote breakfast and lunch down. I didn't write snack or dinner down because I was basically eating the same thing for lunch as a snack or a dinner type of meal. So for breakfast, I would use original egg beaters um, in a carton and I would probably do like a half a cup or just pour a certain amount in the skillet to see if that was enough portion for me to eat. The days that I ate the eggs, I would pair it up with the turkey sausage patty or I would also use turkey bacon. Something else that I would have ate for breakfast is oatmeal. Also, I would eat Fiber One cereal. That's a really good cereal. So yeah, those are my breakfast foods. <laughs> as far as lunch food goes, I would either eat a chicken Caesar salad. Something new that I've recently tried is buffalo wings and they aren't the real buffalo wings, but um, they're veggie. And the brand is Morning Star. If you eat five pieces, it's only 200 calories. I would pair that up with Pizza Bites, and that's also from Morning Star. Something else that I would eat meat and cheese plates, which is just turkey, cheese, and crackers. Something recent, recent that I purchased is Asian Appetizer Assortment. The only thing I wrote down as far as snack. Five fruit blend as a snack comes with five different fruits. Or I would eat bagel chips with cream cheese. That's pretty much it, you guys. If you've seen my previous video before this, 
how to lose 30 pounds in two weeks. I will update you guys next week with that because today is my second day doing that. Um, so yeah, I know I'm totally off the topic because I'm supposed to be talking about 310 Nutrition Shakes. Overall, you guys, I definitely love the shakes. They help me lose weight and I think they're amazing. I lost a total of nine pounds. I definitely could have lost way more weight. I wasn't trying to like be super strict on myself. Some days when I just felt like I needed it, I just went for it. There's no right or wrong way as far as the way I diet. I'm going to diet the way I want to diet. And that's just that. Um, but yeah, overall, I definitely enjoyed the shakes. I would definitely purchase them again. Um, so yeah, that is it. Give this video a big thumbs up. Subscribe to the channel if you aren't already. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.